Dr. Brian Cox says the Cillian Murphy movie is the most accurate sci-fi film ever, and it's not Oppenheimer. We caught up with IWC Ambassador Dr. Brian Cox at this year's Watches and Wonders, where he shared his thoughts on which science fiction film truly impressed him with its accuracy to scientific principles. It didn't come as much of a surprise when he mentioned a 2007 flick starring Cillian Murphy was worth watching, considering he was brought on as a consultant for the film. 2023 concluded with Oppenheimer, a three-hour biopic centered around the Manhattan Project and the troubled American theoretical physicist responsible for the birth of atomic warfare, as the third highest-grossing movie of the year. It flipped the script on the tired old narrative that films had become too long, or that the sci-fi genre, thanks, in part, to the ever-present superhero fatigue, had become too far-fetched and unbelievable for modern audiences to appreciate. So when we had the opportunity to speak with IWC Ambassador Dr. Brian Cox at this year's Watches and Wonders, we had to ask him about his preference for sci-fi feature films and his pick for most accurate. Unsurprisingly, two of Christopher Nolan's celebrated releases made Cox's list. But there was one lesser-known Cillian Murphy-led feature that stood out. Interstellar is brilliant because it was essentially written by a physicist, Kip Thorne, Nobel Prize-winning physicist. So Interstellar is a fantastic thing, Dr. Brian Cox told DMARGE. I worked on a film called Sunshine years ago, which is a lesser-known film. Danny Boyle directed it. Cillian Murphy is in it, who of course just won the Oscar for Oppenheimer. Oppenheimer, by the way, is a brilliant film. So Sunshine is worth watching, partly because I worked on it, and partly because Cillian always says that he did an impression of me in it. Released in 2007, Sunshine is a sci-fi thriller directed by famed English filmmaker Danny Boyle and boasts an all-star cast of some of Hollywood's biggest names including Cillian Murphy, Chris Evans, Michelle Yeoh and Australia's Rose Byan. The film follows the crew of the Icarus II, faced with a dangerous mission to reignite Earth's dying sun, a last-ditch effort to save humanity, and stop the planet from plunging into the next ice age. Okay, maybe it's a bit far-fetched, but Dr. Brian Cox revealed that he visited the European Organization for Nuclear Research alongside Cillian Murphy to gain a better understanding of astrophysics to prepare for the film. Talk about going above and beyond.